Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this video, we are going to learn how to use and how to add that XML add in variance covariance add in by clicking on the this download link. The add in is automatically downloaded. When you open it, it is added. You can see it is added let me break that into the screen you can see this V <coughs> it shows that the add-in has been added now to find the variance and covariance matrix first of all we need to give weights to each observation because according to this add-in we need to give a weights the weights are equal to 1 divided by the number of observations you can quickly count the number of observation by pressing shift control and down arrow key and you can see on the status bar there are 734 observations the weight assigned to each observation is equal to 1 divided by 734 so you can double click on it and the weights, is assign, uh, weights are assigned to all observations accordingly. Now we are in a position to find the variance covariance matrix. Click on the variance covariance icon. The input range is all these observations from start to end. Select all these and then come back. Then we have included we have included these labels in the first row so click on this the weights we have already calculated those weights and if you have made a mistake by and your air weights do not add to one they do not sum to one you will get an error message in this column we have to give the output range the output range I give this I select this whole column so automatically sheet 1 F and dollar I to dollar I means that the whole column has been selected okay we are now set and we can press control okay it says that the output range contain data click okay to all right yes we agree that it should be all written now you can see the weights has been assigned now to find the variance covariance thing with this uh, we need to give weights copy and then paste special you can do that <coughs> paste special and click on transpose the, these words will be uh, we needed to pay special and use values so this gives us all the words that we need okay now the matrix multiplication formula can be used that is equal to MMULT select these words comma MMULT select the range of variance covariances and then these words and then ok the variance of the portfolio is 0 0.0031 taking a square root of this is 0 0.017 and multiplying that amount with the amount in portfolio that is 660 um, which is given in you can see which is given in B8 so the amount that we that uh, the, the standard deviation of this portfolio is 117.02 thank you very much for listening